Hey, this is Reginald Perryman with There's Something About Real Estate. We got Shaka over here on one of his renovation projects. Here, this is a full gut job. What are you doing in here? Literally everything. everything. All right. Literally. All right. Literally everything. This one when really goes uh, Oh, yeah, the floor out. Yeah, the so when we, um, when we on the show talking real estate, we talking from experience. All right. But we opening this up. This is an open concept for the kitchen. Let me use that water. All right. But it's all gonna be open. Yeah, the before and after is on this gonna be crazy. But um, here I show you what I need. So we're closing this off. So this kind of off of the kitchen. Right. It is off. So we're closing it off right here. All right. We're gonna get rid of all this stuff in here, and we're gonna put a door to the um the bedroom. All right. So it's gonna have a first floor master suite. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Yep. And um, so over here, what they're doing right now, we be doing this uh, porch. All right. So they got it out. Stairs. This stair is that they got here. They yeah. They don't have oh yeah, you can't even get down there. Mm -hmm. really. You know how they gotta wash the down there. Yeah. So we're gonna start the stairs coming from here. From this area right here, and then when we get down, we're gonna have enough stairs there. All right. Turn around. So you be doing the whole staircase. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, and some of these older houses, they built them like that. They weren't using them the same yeah. way they use them now. Yeah. <clears throat> so this property is over in the uh, Royal Oak Township area which is the borderline of Ferndale and Oak Park. So this area is coming up. The values are popping up pretty quick yeah. over here because people getting out bid for Oak Park mm -hmm. and for Ferndale. So this is the next best thing. But man, y'all got a job, <laughs> job on y'all. I can see clear through hey, look, outside. Yeah, because it's Ferndale School mm -hmm. District. So this is something I tell people too, like when we um when you buy a house in certain areas here and it can be in a certain city, but it might be in the school district for another city. Mm -hmm. That means all the difference. So. A lot of the clients right now, that's what they they're looking for. Well, not not everybody, but a lot of them like oh, yeah. I got a good school for my kids. But, yeah. So when they come here, they're gonna have a whole it's gonna be a totally remodeled four bedroom, two bathroom. Okay. Two hours, you have to ride. Yep. So, totally all right. So, when we be talking on, to Shaka on the show about mm -hmm. about renovations, we we really doing it. So, in about um, what you think, several months from now, yeah, you'd be done because we're not cause gonna be here right now. We just getting it tightened up. We kind of closing in for the winter time to make sure that in the winter time, we, we always have something to do, right? Okay, yeah, we're not about to jump on it for real, right? Uh, we're gonna do that exit. All right, so when we was talking on the show about projects that I wouldn't touch personally, this is a project that they could do because it works for him because he has the work crew and everything. But the numbers make sense. I mean, it's a good deal. So we're going to have to show this one when it's done. Yeah, we'll, we'll show it step, you know what we do? After we get the framing done and then yep. after, we get to the, after we did the roof, uh, electrical plumbing and everything. Right. This was the uh, chimney that I took out. Oh, okay. I took it out because that was this in the middle of the kitchen. Yeah. Uh, so I wasn't that open concept. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I can see. Mm -hmm. So nothing like a hole in the roof. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So look, it looks look better than it did when we got it. Oh, yeah. Look, it is our, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's crazy, but it still do look like a mountain of work. It's not, though. Right. Once we get the framing, she's gonna get the majority of that done today. Right. I'll get, he got a few things outside. Yeah, once you get your, get all your demo and your framing up, you pretty much good to go, yeah. You got your roof and all that in place.
Yeah. Yeah. You can see what somebody did here, so I don't know if y'all can see it, but oh, yeah. the Boy. difference in the wood. This is why you got to hire real contractors, people. Somebody, because, well, I mean, of course, it's oh, that's going to be redone, but somebody paid somebody for that. <laughs> yeah, probably did. From the looks of the wood or something. Yup. Yeah, so that's another thing. When you gut these houses down like that, you can see like a lot of like the bad work that was done over the years. Like you'll see like some old knob and tube wiring tied into some other wiring. Um, you can see the framing is off. You can see like, um, you can see here under the roof. You can see right outside, so like, when they re yeah, when they redid that, they didn't even try to line it up properly. You can see here, on uh, here. This one is. Yeah, how it's off. Look over here. Yeah. This is stuff that you be careful with. This stuff might be good. Yep. But, uh, yeah, this is your actual roof truss. You know what I mean? That they just, this is a ratchet. Yeah. Okay. If you standing on that, I know nobody ain't standing on the roof, but still. Yeah, yeah but if somebody was standing right there, they would fall through the roof. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Even, even though they tried to push and everything. Yeah. So this is what you see people do when they do a half ass job yeah. on something. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, Another project in, there's something about real estate. Follow us on the podcast, uh, Spotify, and all of that good too. Yes, sir. Yeah, Facebook. We out here doing these deals for real.